what's up guys so first welcome back to my channel if you have not already go ahead and go and subscribe to my channel today I kind of have not a busy day but today is the first day of this week it's Monday I think yeah today's Monday and it's gonna be a very very busy week for me or not very very busy it's not too bad I feel like I just get stressed out kind of easy but this weekend is my gender reveal so I'm super excited I officially get to figure out what the heck I'm having um which is of course exciting because you know then you can start doing the nursery and buying clothes and you know doing all that fun stuff um but so right now I'm currently eating breakfast I'm just eating plain wheat toast and applesauce why you may ask because that's the only thing that sounds good but today is gonna be super exciting for me because <clears throat> one I'm going to get my nails done and I have not had my nails done in a long time I'm getting them done for my gender reveal but yeah anyways also today um, on my list of stuff I have to do I'm gonna do this a little bit later this is the gender prediction kit so one of my friends sent me a TikTok, and they were doing basically one of these and basically all you do is it's kind of like a pregnancy test like you like you have to like pee in a cup and then get it in the syringe and put it in this little vial thing this little test tube type of thing and then whenever you shake it up it mixes with the powder and then it gives you a color and then it's gonna be like you have to see which one it's closer to if it's green it's gonna be a girl and if it's blue it's a boy um, this is not by all means anything accurate. Um, it's kind of just for fun But I'm curious to see what it is because everyone in my family Well, not everyone but pretty much everyone thinks it's a boy so everyone has been saying he 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 whatever and There's only like a handful of people that think it's a girl So I'm really curious to see what this is gonna say and then I'm just super excited to actually find out what it is but yeah, so I think that's going to be a lot of fun to do. So I'm going to do that a little bit later today after I like eat and all that good stuff. I've been sitting here on TikTok for like 30 minutes because I don't know why I'm like this. But I want to show you guys really quick some of the stuff that we got for the um, gender reveal. So let's go check that out. So um, really quick, let me just show you guys this nursery because this is this originally so okay let me start from the beginning so we have a friend that is living with us right now um and he was staying so we have a three bedroom house he was staying in the middle bedroom but we ended up switching the room so that way the baby could be in the middle bedroom and it's going to be our room on one side of it and then on the other side of it is going to be um andrew's room so yeah but basically what I did was that room the other room or what this room was intentionally for before we found out I was pregnant was it was an office slash beauty room and so we had like a bunch of like decor in there and I had all my makeup stuff my vanity we had an office desk with all of our computers and our printer and like all that stuff but now that um, we're having to do a nursery I don't have room for all that so I had to move my vanity into my bedroom which is fine it fits it's you know whatever um but i have like a hot mess in this room because everything that doesn't really have a home or stuff that i need to like figure out what i'm gonna do with is um in this room <laughs> and then also we just got a new bed and um bed frame but we have to paint the bed frame but anyways so that's also in this room because we still have our old bed but I need to switch those out but we want to paint the bed frame first so yeah there's just a whole this room is just a mess but let me just show you what it looks like so this is it we have the ginormous bed right here there's pieces of the bed frame there's Christmas decor there's a tool bag there's like little vase decor and stuff there's an extra TV that's gonna go in our room there's tripods and camera equipment over there. Um, I don't know, backpacks and half empty pillows from me switching them out to my Christmas ones. A bag full of random stuff. Like there's literally just so much like random stuff everywhere. But what's also in here is the stuff for our 
gender reveal. But so the first thing we got is I got two of these platters. They're just like little rectangle serving platters. I got two of them the exact same size because we're going to use these to put um, desserts on one of them. And then because I have like cupcakes and cookies coming. And then um, on the other one, we're going to have like a bunch of finger foods like crackers and cheese and I don't know, like fruits and vegetables. I don't know. My I put my best friend in charge of filling up the finger food stuff. So let's see what her mind comes up with. Next, I got some straws that have, they're just white paper straws with gold stars all over them. That is going to be sitting on the table um, for the drinks and everything. And then I got a balloon arch that have white balloons with... Um, like gold stars and then like the clear balloons with the gold little circles all over it it doesn't have a picture of it it's just that but that's not what the, like the color scheme that i got but yeah i don't know how to do this i'm also getting my nails done today and i have to tie like 50 something balloons because we have these plus my mom also got these boxes um it's these white boxes. These are the boxes that you see pretty much at every baby shower or gender reveal where they say like they have letters and then there's like four of them stacked up and they say baby like it's B-A-B-Y whatever. Why am I out of breath? But anyways so we have to build these and since they're white with clear um like whatever that's called like little plastic or whatever. Um, you're not really gonna be able to see that see them very well So we bought a pack of colorful balloons whenever you blow them up They're supposed to be a little more pastel because I I don't want this much color <laughs> But um, when you blow them up, they're supposed to be a little bit more pastel. So hopefully They're like the pictures and they're actually pastel um, But we're gonna blow some of these up and put them in here. So I have to blow up enough balloons to fit in four of these boxes plus make a balloon arch and my nails are gonna be like Two inches long i also got a moon a gold moon um balloon you can't really tell in here but it's just like a little crescent moon and i'm gonna put that on the balloon arch as well um then i got these stickers these are for like boy or girl as team stashes or team lashes i thought this was so cute because i'm i love makeup and just the team lashes like sold me i was like yep buying it so I thought these were cute so everyone can put these on whenever they get here um, and we can see. Or then like everyone will say like whether they're team boy or team girl or whatever. So I thought this was cute. Next is a backdrop that I got. I'm just going to insert a picture of what it's supposed to look like. Um, but I got this backdrop and since I used to do sit down makeup videos, um, I have a backdrop stand. Which is very nice because I'm going to end up putting this backdrop on the backdrop stand with the balloon arch and it's just gonna be perfect because I don't have to like rig anything or build anything. You'll see the whole setup um, next week whenever I post um, the gender reveal vlog. Okay, so Anthony um, is already on the way home. So yeah, it's only 11.30 and he's already on the way home which is weird because he never comes home this early. He always comes home at like late late. But, um, so I'm going to go ahead and do this gender prediction thing. Hopefully it works. Hopefully I have enough pee. <laughs> um, I've been downing water, but he doesn't like to be on camera or like he's not used to it. So I don't, I try my best not to like film around him because one, I get freaking nervous because I'm a pansy and two, because, um, he just doesn't, I don't know, like he doesn't mind me filming. But he just doesn't like to be a part of it and I'm still not comfortable enough to like just be filming. So I'm going to go ahead and do this and then we'll see the results. I'm so excited. But okay, I'll be right back. Okay, so I did the little syringe thingy. Um, now I'm about to pour it inside of the little test tube. This is what the test tube looks like before anything. I hope you can see it. I have the syringe in my other hand. But this is what the little test tube looks like. It has like these blue little bead things in it. I don't know. But okay, I'm about to squirt the sample <laughs> into the little tube. And then I'm going to shake it up and show you guys. It doesn't say how long I'm supposed to shake it for. Okay, so this is 
what it looks like. I would say that's more on the green side than it is on the blue. What do y'all think? Look. That is definitely green. That's, <laughs> Anthony's not gonna like that. Well, I mean, it's not that he's not gonna like it, but he's so scared to become a girl dad. What's up? Would you say this is green or blue? Green? That means a girl? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look. It'd be green, right? I would say green. What if we have a girl? You gonna be scared? Yeah. Dang. I mean, this Wait, isn't. How accurate is that? Yeah, this isn't like super accurate. It's just like it says experiment only or entertainment only, whatever. So it's not very accurate. Oh, okay. But, it, like, I don't know. I don't know, bro. We'll see. We're gonna find out on Saturday. Okay, guys, so I just got back from getting my nails done. They're so freaking cute i let her freestyle on them she kind of just picked out like whatever she wanted um as long i just told her that i want like stars and clouds and you know all that good stuff and then she only did the two fingers the pink and the blue because i didn't want it to be like an overload of blue and pink but i'm outside because i also wanted to show you guys that anthony was kind enough to completely clear out our backyard as well as the lot next to us because we're going to end up taking out one of these panels like from post to post we're gonna take it out completely and it's like a an, literally an empty lot next to us so we're gonna use that for parking or we're gonna use half of it for parking and half of it for um like we're gonna have a cornhole set up and stuff like that so anthony actually cleaned out this entire spot so over here we're gonna have um this whole panel is gonna be out but the poles are staying so we're gonna have a balloon arch that's gonna go above that and we're gonna tie it to each post um, ignore all of his ladders that kind of has to stay there we have nowhere else to put it but he's gonna make it um, like nice and neat and he's gonna push it a little bit more into that corner um, but there's still gonna be a few ladders but anyways so we're gonna have the balloon arch there tables are gonna be lined up all through here and then over on the patio I'm gonna clear that off and have a table for food and then here is where like the main attraction is gonna be so it's gonna have like the backdrop with you know the table that has all the desserts and all that good stuff on it um so all that's going to be right here so as soon as you walk in from under the balloon arch that's the first thing you're going to see the lot next to us um is the empty lot so i'm going to show you guys that really fast it's just it's literally just an empty lot and he let me see if i can show you so it's just an empty lot over the fence he just completely cleared it out um, that way people can park on that side, come through the um, balloon arch and all that stuff straight into our backyard, which is going to have all the tables and chairs and all that stuff set up. So then that will literally be it. And I think everything is pretty much ready. The only thing left for me to do is pick up the cupcakes and the cake. I mean the cupcakes and cookies and then literally just like put together the balloon arches, which is going to be a task considering I just got my nails done. But yeah. That's gonna be fun. But we're about to head off to a barbecue at our friend's house. And I think they're making like fajitas and stuff. They always make it bomb. So I'm super excited, but your girl's craving Arby's right now. I don't know why. A lot of people always make fun of me because I'm the only one that, like me and my mom are the only people that I know that actually enjoys Arby's and craves it. So I'm gonna try and convince Anthony to stop and get me some Arby's. But anyways, that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next week which is going to be my actual gender reveal so you guys will get to find out what i'm having as well so i will see you guys next week bye guys